Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to calculate force between two electric charges. Now the force between two electric charges can be found using Coulomb's law in electrostatics. So before going any further, let us learn what is Coulomb's law. Now the Coulomb's law states that the electrostatic force of interaction between two point charges is directly proportional to the product of the charges, inversely proportional to the square of the distance between them and acts along the line joining the two charges. Now it is important to note here that Coulomb's law applies to stationary point charges. To represent Coulomb's law mathematically, consider two point charges QA and QB separated by a distance R. Now let F be the electrostatic force between these two point charges. Now according to Coulomb's law, this force F is directly proportional to product of the charges. That is, this force F is proportional to QA times QB and this force F is inversely proportional to square of the distance between these two charges. That is, it is inversely proportional to R square. Now combining these two relations, we get F is equals to K QA QB upon R square. Here this K is a constant of proportionality and is called electrostatic force constant. Now in SI units, value of this constant K is equals to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught which is approximately equals to 9 times 10 to the power 9 Newton meter whole square per coulomb whole square where this epsilon naught is permittivity of free space or vacuum. To understand how to calculate force between two charges, let us consider this question. Now the question states that two positive charges of 3 into 10 to the power minus 4 coulombs and 8 into 10 to the power minus 4 coulombs are separated by 0.3 meters. What is the force between these two charges? Let us now solve this problem step by step. In our first step, we would analyze and sketch the problem. We can do so with the help of a diagram to show charges and the distance between them. And uh, after that, we will label the force acting between the charges. So let us now look at the diagram. Now from this diagram, we can clearly see that we have two charges. One is QA and another one is QB. And these two charges are kept at a distance are apart. And this force F is force on charge QA due to charge QB. In our next step, we would write down the known and unknown quantities as given in the question. So it is given in the question that charge QA is equals to 3.0 into 10 to the power minus 4 coulomb. Charge QB is equals to 8.0 into 10 to the power minus 4 coulomb. And the distance between these two charges is 0 0.3 meter. And our unknown quantity here is Fb which is force on force on charge QA due to charge QB. Now step 3 of our problem is to solve for the unknown quantities. Now here we have to find the force between the two charges in this problem. So force on charge QA due to charge QB can be calculated using Coulomb's law. So for these two charges QA and QB, Coulomb's law is F is equals to K QA QB 
upon r square now plugging in all these values we get force f is equals to 9 times 10 to the power 9 newton meter whole square per coulomb square times 3 into 10 to the power minus 4 coulombs times 8 into 10 to the power minus 4 coulombs divided by 0.3 meter whole square now on calculating it we get force f is equals to 2.4 into 10 to the power 4 newton so this is our required answer okay thanks for watching this video i hope you find it helpful 